Hi there and welcome to the Lomo Essentials show. So just started that Lomography Kick. and all you need is one camera. Oh no, don't touch that. So <coughs> but the path of Lomography is mysterious. You can enjoy one camera for ages or you can start and collect as many cameras as possible. Now you wanna do it without spending any money? So here are a bunch of cameras, not all of them are toy cameras, but most of them can be qualified as toy cameras. I'm gonna make you an essential collection. Which one do you need, which one you don't. So I'm gonna start with this one because the baby is gonna take it. It's a Reseski do-it-yourself camera. It costs like uh, 12 euros. Uh, I'm still... Uh, trying to figure it out how to put it together. <laughs> so this one is not an essential. Ta -da! So your first resources or resources it's a resource is your family. You go to a family as uh, always carry a camera and they will very soon mm, go to their attics and get you a bunch of cameras. Uh, da -da -da -da. Always say thanks. Do not refuse them. What you, you're gonna get cheap cameras. For instance, this Kodak. Uh, always put name tags on it. Uh, pocket camera. How does it open? I, I have used it. So yes, it, it shoots 110 10 film. So that's very cool because at the Lomography shop you can get. 110 film puff. You're happy with this one, but uh, so it's free. You will get uh, focus-free stuff like this. Uh, what you do is you give it to your baby and they play play with it. Uh, lots of you're gonna get lots of one uh, this 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 stuff and this stuff. Uh, Kodak Instamatic. It shoots. Use 126 film only. Can't do anything with it. You say thank you. You put it away. So rubbish. Thing. <coughs> or this. This is a nice Honeymax. Uh, that one you can use. Then you try it. It needs. It needs batteries only for the flash unit. So it works without any batteries. We're gonna keep that one. A Halina Panorama. It's really cheap <laughs> crap. <laughs> That's what you want. Look, there's a film inside. I put it in last year and I noted 400 color. So the moment I write this, I think, why do I do it? Uh, I shoot all my rolls within a day. No, you don't. Hey, you even can. Hey, my grandma had this uh, 127. Bancini made in Italy. It was a funny, funny camera, but problem is it's difficult to get 127 film, but they still make it. In Canada, Blue Fire, but they're always out of stock. So that's nice, but you can't actually use it. Uh, so I've got three of them. Now I'm gonna kill some cameras which are not essential. Creep. First of all, the samplers. Come on, give it to me. Give it to daddy. Yep. Sampler number two. Uh, this is a sample. The, the mo yep. These samplers are fun. But we're gonna try and make an essential collection of about 200 euros. Uh, mm, one trick ponies. If you're bored of everything, buy it. They don't, you, yeah, they don't give me much satisfaction. Yeah. This one is like actually the funniest of them all. Come on. It's the super sampler. It weighs like 20 grams. When you put a roll of film in it, it doubles in you know, price and it doubles in weight. So, not one essential. Uh, a, ba a baby fish eye. Very funny, you don't need it. 
So your second re uh, in your family, someone will give you an SLR, definitely. Uh, I've got two, four. I'm still in the family business, huh? Oh, Supply. This is. A, oh, I'm gonna move the camera a little bit. Uh, I, I told you this is gonna be chaotic as shit. So I've got a nice Contaflex with a 35 millimeter lens on it, a Minolta SRT 101, and a Minolta. This one I got for free on, on the market, but I got it for free. So don't say, hey, I have already one, because this one broke down. So, yep. And this one has a 50 millimeter lens, the other one a 35. So you build a little collection and you don't pay for it, actually. No, no, no. Another one I'm gonna remove first. Very fun. Uh, this a very old limited helmet CD. Don't give it to the baby. Uh, the spinner 360. Ooh, real funny, but that's for when you had all the other half, all the other cameras. You're bored. Want to have some fun? You have some money. But actually, an essential. I don't think it is. I'm sorry. Sorry. So, what you get from your family? Oh, box cameras. The second resource is the flea market, the garage sale. There you find stuff like this. Uh, your family. A Kodak brownie. I paid two euros for it. Not an essential. It's a stupid, <laughs> boring camera. Uh, here is, here he is, the Zeiss Zeiss Econ Tangor box. This thing is of reasonable quality. It, it has, well, no, tuck tuck, focusing modes. No, they, these are diaphragms. F25, F18, and F16. And then here you have a lever, close six meters infinity. So this this guy works. We're gonna keep it in the essential collection yeah because i got it for free these ones i got you get for free too when you're living in europe every family has like an afka achfa klaka did it i'm gonna give one away by the way uh, this one this is mine um so afka klak it's nice it shoots nice pictures that's the afka klak uh, what will you get also, and you can't get, have enough of them, but because they don't always work, it's a Polaroid. It's not actually an essential, because that's fun. This Polaroid, a Rada, is very funny to look up, but it works with a yeah, kind of film you won't find anymore. So, just go, every time somebody says, I have an old Polaroid, say yes, give it to me. Until you find one that works with uh, 600 film, huh? This, this Polaroid 600 land camera. Yes. It says, I'm good. this one hasn't, hasn't got a flash unit. You can attach flashes, but boom, they explode. This one has a flash. I'm gonna put that one in my essential collection because I got it for free. So, basically, I already spent two euros. Yeah, and I've got one, two, three, four, five, six cameras. No, seven, eight. Mm. So now the, the, the free part is over. Gonna remove two cameras. Ah, painful Lomu LC white. This one has to come on your I wanna get it list after I shot with all the free cameras. It's really nice. It's a great, great, great camera. Oh, 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 I love it. Oh, 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 I love it. But it costs like 349 euros. So it doesn't fit in my 300 euro collection of today. Ta-da! It's loaded. It's always loaded. Loaded, loaded, loaded. 
Next is the LCA. Definitely inessential. You don't need to. I'm so scared that one should break down that I have two of them. No. Um, they're expensive, but these are the old Russian ones, not the new ones. You cannot do multiple exposures with them. Uh, but oh, 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 sorry, I have a baby to attend. No, okay, it's all right. Uh, mm, paid 80 euros for it, 110 for the other. So I'm gonna keep the 80 euro one in my collection of today because this one is too expensive. <laughs> so the old Russian ones you can find for a price on the internet. Take a risk. Uh, these two both work perfectly fine. Da, 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 da. They need different batteries than the new ones. Uh, hey, you have internet, you're watching it, so go and buy yourself a camera. Uh, next stop as remove one camera. This is <coughs> like the LC White. I must, 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 must have. But the problem is. It's too expensive for today's uh, show. It's not yeah, easy. It's not. It's not loaded. There's like here. I put the valve. Thirty-six valve. Yeah. No. It's, it's empty. Take a risk. Let's take a risk. Uh, <laughs> you really want to have a horizon. A horizon. You have the compact. You have the perfect. And you have the old 202. Uh, this one is the cheapest, actually. <laughs> it works, so it's out of my essential collection. Uh, da, 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 da. Like when you go to flea markets and you discover stuff like this, it's a Minolta Hymatic 7 rangefinder. Very nice camera, weighs about 700 grams. Pum, pum, pum. Uh, needs a battery, mercury battery, which is not made anymore for the light meter, but it works perfectly well without a light meter. You don't have to go and look for this kind of stuff, uh, but when you come across it, doesn't cost you any money, go and buy it. The uh. Lumos, Schmima, on the symbol. This one, uh, this one, this Mima 8M, everybody loves it. It does multiple exposures. Uh, you cock the shutter like this, you shoot, you cock it again, you shoot, you wind it, wing, 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 you cock it, you shoot. Uh, these go on eBay about three euros. Uh, I, I still, I already have it, but I still follow them on eBay to see what price they go. Uh, this is a, a symbol. It's heavier, better built, but yeah, it doesn't do multiple exposures. You, this is loaded, so we're gonna take a picture. Uh, <laughs> T -t 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 ISO 800, let's try one t -t 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 bulb 1530, then put it on maximum aperture of 4, distance close, shoot, wind. <laughs> That's your symbol. This, this you want one of these or two. I paid ten euros for them, both shipping cost included. So it was two euros for the cameras, eight euros for the shipments. So I'm gonna put this in my essential collection, especially because the brand is Lomo. Da -da -da -da. Then you you definitely want to have a medium format. Camera. Uh, this is an Afka Isola. I other the boxes are medium format too. Anyway, uh, I've seen nice results from this model, not from this camera. This one is um, the shutter is a bit broken. So. Yep, gone. Next, 
you want to have a plastic is fantastic camera uh, this is a, a 60s Diana Deluxe or 70s anyway they, they, they did only make it in the 60s and 70s I think it's funny it shoots uh, it has only you can't replace the lens uh, it's loaded with a mm, ISO 100 Delta Ilford, I think, black and white. Funny camera. But I'm not gonna put it into the essentials because I paid 15 euros for it. But I think it's difficult to find, but I'm not sure. Uh, Holha, very nice camera. It's my favorite. Uno Lenza, flash built inside. The, never forget to tape your holha because the back, yeah. in my case, it always fa falls off. Holha always shoots with a mask, even when you're shooting 6x6. Six six. This is fun because you can tape a, a black cardboard over here, cut out a piece, uh, put f stick filters to it. You will hear, hear about this later. Uh, can, you can put in a 4x4 four four mask and then so, or you go for the Diana it's better promoted these days it, 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 uh, you can change lenses and this this is um, 38 millimeter super wide this is the cheapest way to go this wide when you want to have a 40 millimeter Hasselblad lens you will pay 1000 euros or more <laughs> here, here you have a 38 millimeter well, for free basically so um, what I you have more aperture 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 settings on the Diana and the back closes better uh, weak points of the Diana the inside where it holds your film rolls this part is weak I'm a clumsy guy it comes off and breaks also, uh, the shutter is a, a tiny springy thing I don't like, and the bulb uh, normal setting is very loose. So when you change lens lenses, you hit, you can break it off, or you 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 put it in a different mode without you knowing it. Uh, you hit the shutter without you knowing it. Uh, yeah. Minor convenience. Uh, no, uh, this one I have like for seven years, so uh, for me it's difficult to choose. And the, the Diana you can put on dip different lenses. Mm. Yeah, you want them. You, you want them both. Uh, like this, this is sturdier. The shutter, tuck tuck, is here. The yeah, you know, there's a cloudy and sunny setting. I don't know about the new versions, but on the old versions it does not work. It, it just stays the same <laughs> and the bulb normal switch is on the back you won't you will not switch this by accident uh, need them both so this is in my collection mm. the whole heart 3d i'm gonna remove this is fun yeah. not because you can shoot 3d uh, pictures uh, uh, slides and put them in the viewfinder. That's the stupid part. The funny part is that you have two whole hus for the price of two whole hus. One shutter, uh, two flashes. You can do lots of funny things with this one. Uh, consider this as an extension to your basic set. You don't need this for starters. You need one pinhole camera. I have three toy cameras in the pinhole section. I'm gonna remove one. It's the white. Uh, what is the uh, so, uh, when you're new at Lomography you don't need the white. So then you have to choose between the 135. This one is currently there is a Hoya infrared filter on it and an infrared film inside. Um, yeah, where, where did I put my filter? 
so uh, I have no. It, basically, the camera doubles in price <laughs> when you put an infrared filter on it. Uh, the funny thing about those whole houses is they have a, a rim like here. It's not a filter you cannot scoop, but a, a 52 millimeter Hoya filter just fits on it perfectly. Yeah, and but I, I tape it <laughs> like like this, otherwise it will fall off. So. Uh, ah! I... Yeah. Oh, oh, hey, hello! Is this the first time she's standing? It is the first time. This is the first. <laughs> Rosalie, 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 stand up. Yeah. Applause. Hey. Hey. Hey, funny! So, this was the first time she was standing alone! Uh, okay. So, you have to choose between a 135 or a, a medium format. <coughs> That's your own little choice. They both they did not cost a lot of money. Never forget to tape the back of a whole house because it falls off. This one not. This closes like a normal camera. Uh, I prefer the medium format because it has only got 12 exposures. So uh, I like to shoot fast and see the result. Uh, here I got 36 exposures in this film. It's on it for yeah three months already. And I, uh, so two cameras left, and they're both essentials to me. Uh, La Sardina. Um, you can go it's a white camera it's not as white as they say uh, don't buy the metal version that's it's, you, you just pay the design basically it is a stupid plastic cheap ca camera and uh, it should stay stupid plastic cheap camera so this uh, copper housing is ridiculous uh, I, uh, uh, you have to pull out uh, the lens yep, blah, and then it has to click no baby no don't take this uh, then you has to click so when you're shooting just leave it out like that uh, then you wind it and you click it oh 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 uh, it's a it's a funny it's a funny cheap camera uh, you can do multiple exposures by pulling the MX, MX button, multiple exposures. I don't like that. I like rather my favorite camera. It's the Sprocket Rocket. Ta -da! This is this one is the I think the most essential one of the whole collection. If you don't have it, run to your shop. Go to the online shop, get one. It's cheap. It's fun it's all a camera has to be it has a lens it has a viewfinder uh, it's plastic <laughs> you open it you shoot it you shoot it so you don't have to use an MX button you can just say click 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 this is fun because when you're shooting a building you can just shoot and move your camera a little and then the build building will be chuck 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 several times on your frame and slightly uh, in another position when you have to move the camera down push the MX button it's impossible to get the same angle of where you were shooting from uh, it doesn't stop when you wind so you can just keep on winding it really 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 and, and spoil the whole film and you can also you do not have to push a button to rewind it you just can rewind it so you can do funny stuff wind a little shoot rewind a little shoot wind a little shoot rewind a little shoot uh, endless panoramas where yeah. there is a, a counter here that's so you can actually follow when you have to shop stop winding when you want to yeah, basically you want to stop winding because you don't want to spoil film uh, it has only two settings cloudy 
and sunny and two focusing modes close and far and it has a hot show so when you put the flash on it it will fire the flash this one in fact forget all about the other ones so now we're gonna make the bill the bill the bill i don't know what this costs 50 euro 30 euros if it's cheap uh, the plastic version of this um, maybe 30 without a flash 50 with a flash so let's say 80 euros um a whole hard yeah I mean, i'm gonna go over 200 baby move aside come i did it yet that it come 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 so ta -ta -ta, ta -ta -ta, ta -ta -ta. so let's say uh, uh, as a beginning guy you don't need a diana and a holga uh nope mm, diana has more lenses but it, when you have to pay for the lens so we go we will go for the holga Ta -ta -ta. Yep, uh, you don't want two pinholes you go for the medium format one yep, this is the way this stuff is all for free yeah 80 euros for the lomo and another hundred for the holha, the holha pinhole, you, you, you want to have them for 100 euro, let's say 150. So I spent 220 euros, and what do I have? A holha pinhole, a holha, normal holha, a Sella Sardina sprocket rocket, a Lomo LCA, Minolta reflex camera, a Contaflex, Lomo Schmema, Lomo Symbol. <laughs> A Mikono. Yep, uh, here, baby, you can have it. Uh, an Afga clock, a box, a Polaroid, and some other stupid cameras. Uh, the Minolta Highmatic is not a stupid camera. So, 250 euros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. 16 cameras. Yeah. Da -da 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 -da. So, if this is still overwhelming to you, Minolta Highmatic. Not an essential. That's a nice extension. Those, hopla, this Halina is this. If you, ha if they give it to you, you say thank you. Hopla. A Polaroid, to me, it's essential. A box camera, the Icon nine. Afra clock is essential. A Lomo is essential. You only need one SLR, preferably. A 35 millimeter lens. Uh, so we're sizing down the clock. When you're new at lomography, it's not difficult to use, but it has it's a 30th second and f11. So you need to find ISO 50 or ISO 100 film when the weather is not fine. Uh, is it essential? It's a classic, but is it essential? No, it isn't. Hapla. Uh, Do you need an Mema and a symbol? No, you don't. Uh, I prefer. Sorry, guys. You, I know you all go for the 8M. I go for the symbol. Hapla. Uh, so now we have downsized it to one medium, one baby. Look. You're a camera baby. Yes, thank you. Uh -huh. We have sized it down to one pinhole camera, one LCA, one sprocket rocket, one holha. You can choose a Diana too. A sardina. Oh, you don't need the flash and you don't need the metal. A Polaroid. Yes, a Polaroid is essential. Mm -hmm. Problem with Polaroid is you get it for free, but the film is so expensive. So I'm gonna leave it for today's blah blah blah. 
The baby. Rosalie, geef me de camera terug. Yes.